when you used to not spend all your money on Amazon and Groupon, that's me, my wife has put me on a spending ban because of Groupon. When you used to be able to get through a McDonald's drive through in less than 30 seconds, and now it's taking over two hours. When you used to be able to do stuff, and we kind of call it the glory days, the glory days, the good old days. And uh, I don't know about you, but there's many glory days. I know Gary would know a lot about glory days because he supports Manchester United. But there's a lot of things about glory days, just looking back and going, those were the best days. But I want to read from Isaiah 43 this morning, because I believe this is a scripture for us to be able to hold on to and look into as a church today. It says this in Isaiah 43, verse 16, it says, this is what the Lord says. It says, he made a way through the sea, a path through the mighty waters who drew out the chariots and horses, the army and reinforcements together, and they lay there, never to rise again. They were extinguished, snuffed out like a wick. That's God talking about the glory days. And then this is what he says. He says, forget the former things. Do not dwell on the past. See, I'm doing a new thing. <laughs> now it springs up. Do you not perceive it? I'm making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. Man, I love that scripture. I love it because God is talking about the great things that he has done the great things in the past, but he said, hey, listen, don't worry about the past. Don't dwell on the things that were. I'm about to do a new thing. 